And a developing story right now, the two Boulder police officers accused in the shooting death of this neighborhood elk resign. 7 News reporter Lance Hernandez is in the Mapleton neighborhood where that elk was killed. Lance, despite the resignations, an internal investigation continues. Well, so far, and you know, this has been quite the saga. That elk was shot and killed three weeks ago over by that small tree across the street. And today, officers Sam Carter and Brent Kerno turned in letters of resignation to Boulder's police chief, Mark Beckner, and he accepted those letters. Uh, both officers had faced termination for their actions January 1st and 2nd. That's when an elk was shot and killed while eating crab apples off this tree at 9th and Mapleton. Now, Carter told investigators the animal was injured and showing signs of aggression, but investigators later learned that Carter had apparently been planning to shoot the elk for some time. Kerno allegedly showed up to remove the carcass for meat processing. Now, I spoke with neighbors in the last hour and a half. They tell me they are glad the officers have resigned. I believe it's probably in their best interest that they did that, and there's just so much evidence on film out there that I think that was the only recourse they had. Now, in a news release, Police Chief Mark Beckner said the Boulder Police Department does not tolerate this kind of behavior. He said police officers and other members of the department will be held accountable for their actions and behavior. He says we want the community to know how seriously we take this breach of trust. Now, last week, both of those officers uh, were charged with felonies. The DA uh, charged them with forgery, tampering with physical evidence, attempting to influence a public service uh, servant, and conspiracy to commit the crime of unlawful taking of a trophy elk, among others. Live in Boulder, Lance Hernandez, 7 News.